Hello there everyone, so welcome to another episode of this um, Tunneland campaign where we're fighting Linden here. Now this is a big army but kind of depleted. I wish I had more units, especially more cavalry for this. Now they do have some cavalry units and that annoying ballista. I hope I can hit it before it does too much damage. And I sincerely hope that these guys will fall on my stakes or something like that, because there's no other way to deal with this unit. Too powerful. And then there's always this enemy army. And for that, I mean, they have the Elder Ring Archers, which are pretty much their best infantry unit. Yeah, <laughs> no kidding, that's the best infantry unit they have. Well, apart from the Fallus Lords. So the Fallus Lord will have to be the one that I'll, that I'll try to kill. I cannot withdraw which is kind of like a bad thing. I wish he was attacking with smaller unit there, but you know, it's, it's never how you want it. Uh, at least, hopefully, the conquest of this place will be very good so that I can, you know, gain some momentum and, um, you know, start getting more income. Okay, this, this is not a bad spot to deploy. It's quite a decent one. Oh, but this one is better. I can use this as kind of like a deterrent. Like, put my cavalry... Can it fit here? Perfectly. So the cavalry would try to go around against the, towards the ballista, you know. And I do have the stakes, so I'll have to do that. And uh, let's see, something like this, perhaps. So that they, then they will attack here. And I'll put my units on the back. I think I think that's enough. Something like this, perhaps? Yeah, there we go. Stakes. Now, do I want all the stakes like this? Or do I want them like here, for instance? Right, it appears that I put less stakes there, so... Let's see... Like this? How about this? That seems more stakes, so that's cool. Okay, so now I can group you up. Just to group up, you know. Um, this archer, I'm gonna go over here. No skirmish mode. Actually, it's gonna go over here because I count on putting some units here, you know. Uh, probably that will be these guys. Yeah, something like this is in order. I shouldn't have too many units, and I, I'm gonna do this. Just confirm that he doesn't strike me on the lower sides, you know. I'll also put these units like here or something. Yeah, there we go. That these archers, they're gonna go back here. Yeah, there we go. So these units are very good hitters. They're not gonna be threatened by the cavalry because it cannot uh, attack there. These guys are just gonna be here in case he tries to flank with the cavalry. You know? That's cool. I'll also have these guys... I, I have to keep them alive for a long time, so I'm just going to put them quite on the back, because I want these guys to hit the Phallus Lords with everything that they've got. And my generals, they are going to be very necessary, so I'm going to put them here so that they are not under attack by the Ballista for now, and I the think this is a good idea. Okay, so the reinforcements of course are on that side, but I expect him to attack first, so I will be able to deal with two with the armies, uh, you know, kind of depleted, or kind of first one and then the other. There's this Teleri Archer that I really don't mind. The Teleri Archers are kind of like my own archers. They will do damage, but they, it's not significant in itself. So these guys, I'm going to shift one, and you're going to put yourselves here. There we go. And hopefully, yeah, hopefully the cavalry actually engages me. That's cool. I mean, the way they are, they might skip the this, but I can always refresh, you know, reposition my units to make sure that they will flee. Actually, let me put these guys like this. I don't know if he'll draw them, but whatever. Yeah, and this guy, I'm just gonna put it here. I really want them to arrive to the ballista. They're covering the ballista because he knows that the ballista can cause a lot of damage. Yeah, that's my cat over here. Hello, Arya. Show yourself. Hi. Hi. Now get away. Daddy has to work. Go 
becomes skirmish. Oh, by the way, I gotta put these guys on guard mode. Now, the perfect target for these guys would be these Linden units. Okay, he is charging with that cavalry. Hopefully, he's gonna charge like around here or something like that. Because these guys can kill them. And they will always hit a little bit of this. So, he's sending the Teleri archers. They're gonna get some. The casualties. Maybe that'll cause their cavalry to attack. Hopefully. Okay, my archers are attacking his own archers. It's kind of like a waste. But, still better than nothing. Can they hit other units? They still cannot. And he's still covering that. Oh, come on. Please just charge. These guys are actually shaken. They're taking some losses, so that's not a bad deal. Can anyone hit that Linden long spear? Not yet. Yeah, the Bliss is now firing. I wonder if they're firing against these guys. Let me move them away. Or these guys. They usually try to go for that. Okay, the cavalry is trying to go for this area, which is quite nice. Yeah, I can hit the Teleri swordsman there. But I think I can send this cavalry out. That'll be cool. Okay. There we go. He is charging. And he's charging here? Really? Oh, actually, the those guys are, are hitting over here? Oh god, that's so good. They're gonna lose a lot of cavalry units there. How many? 30, 21, and the general in itself. And this cavalry is hitting two units of warbands? That's quite fine. It's quite fine. I don't want you hitting anything, if so we we're gonna like stop this, there. And together. you're gonna hit the ballista, that's perfect. There we go. The Linden Long Spears, they are under attack there, which is awesome. There we go. Cavalry is hitting over there. These guys are killing the te the Tulare Riders. Not really killing them. Yeah, it seems like he's sending the units back. So, let's just do this. It's better to hit those, you know. Did I manage to completely wipe them out? No. And I'm pretty sure that he's gonna attack me, so I gotta move them away. Over here, the Lancer is dead. So, there's no longer uh, an a need, let's say, to kill them completely. Okay, I'm still gonna charge that. Okay, Linden Spears, you're gonna have some company there. And the Stellar Swordsman, I'm doing fine. I think I can move these Clan Spearmen here, and that's it. Only half the enemy Did I manage remains. to completely wipe out the Ballista? Almost. And it seems like the cavalry is not hitting me, so I can keep this up. This is going really well. Yeah, okay, Clan Spearman just attack them on the side. I don't want to send these guys in. You know, for now they're doing great. Actually, these guys are doing terrible. They're killing my men. Okay, these guys manage. That's cool. Okay, that's cool. There we go. You're gonna hit this guy on their backs. There we go. Yeah, the Beast Slayers can keep hitting them, honestly. So, archers are no more. Let's hit these swordsmen so that they don't disrout. And for now, it seems like it's perfect. I don't know why the enemy army is not hitting me. But that's, that's kind of okay. Okay, my... Riders killed most of these guys. Okay, there's the sword, the lance is there. I don't know. I'm just gonna stop this fire. Oh, they're attacking there. Okay, that's that's bad. That's bad. The hills will be ours. Their position, they are. So I guess I should move these guys here. Okay, there's some lances there, and there's some other units. So here's what I'm gonna do. Okay, let's move here. I know that they can avoid that and then cause them to move into move this guy. Okay, Cavalry, you're gonna go over here. 
There we go. Stop that out of fire, because I really want them to die. Yeah, this guy is going to die there, so that's okay. These guys can just deploy. That's cool. That guy is chasing, I don't know how or why. Yeah, he's continued to harass me, so I'm just going to put these guys here. Like this. Okay, that's cool. Okay, he's moving in towards this guy. Okay, if they are moving like that, I'm gonna have to take them out. Probably hunt them with a ho the horseman there. Over there, it's fine. Yeah, there we go. I think this army must rout for me to do something about that. They are not moving yet. I don't know what's happening, but maybe I won't have to fight them too much. This is just to cause them to rout. Yeah, there we go. So I lost 18% of my men with this. That's fine. That's fine. I still have cavalry. Still have these guys. And this guy... Well, honestly, this guy is going to go over here. There we go. Like, these guys can't withstand too much. Especially the spearmen there. So i got to move them here. So this guy plus this guy, you're going to move... Form up a single line. Go. Is he moving in? It appears so. Not yet. So I don't know, maybe after their, the enemies have completely routed, maybe they will move in, I don't know. At least the initial attack was thwarted. I don't know what's happening, but they might attack or they might stay there. I wish they would attack, because certainly having that defensive position is much better. And like, there's the Fallus Lords, it's not like I can do anything. Oh, yeah, they're moving in. Yeah, I thought so. Come forth from the hills. Okay, so these guys really want them to hit from this side. Now, if they are going to attack there. And if the Fallus Lords are anywhere, I'm going to put these guys here. Hopefully out of range, the archers and such. And this guy, if he's going to hit the cavalry again on the on that side... Oh, he's not moving in? Really? Come on, it would be perfect if he would send them in. Yeah, I have to move these guys in. There we go. Is he not going to attack me? Really? I thought he was the attacker. I mean, he actually is. I guess as soon as the last unit leaves the, the terrain, he's going to attack. Right? Not yet. Really? I didn't want to leave that uh, place. Because he has the biggest uh, range with the, uh, with the archers. Okay, he's just moving away. He's deploying, redeploying. I, I wish he would stay like this because that's the general. I could, you know, send a volley on them. Is he not going to attack? Like, seriously? This is the weak flank. And that's the strong flank, actually. Which would go well against me because this is my weak flank. You know? Is he not going to come on? Attack me. Do I have to uh, I think I'll have to send my cavalry unit over there close to them. Yeah, there's no other way. Is there a better spot for me to fight them? Not really, if I'm counting on the, the enemy cavalry hitting me. Yeah, 
he's backing away. Well, really, he's gonna be very soon in range with those archers, so come on. Okay, where's the archer unit? <laughs> there they are. There we go. Did I cause that? Okay, he's deploying here? Really? I mean, this is not an army that I can defeat easily by moving in, you know? I'll lose a lot of units. So what are you doing? Let's move these guys around and see if I can catch them or force them. There we go, there's some archers. No? He's regrouping the units. Yeah, now he's coming. Yeah, now he's coming. So the cavalry is on that side, which is kind of something. But I don't mind. I, it, it's one of the things like I, I have to clump up to defend against the cavalry, but I don't want to to clump up uh, because um, because the the archers will get more effectiveness and they will just cause more casualties overall, and also I won't be able to fight these guys clumped up. You know, I have to put one unit against them so that the others can envelop and stuff. Now right now this cavalry unit is a problem. I'll have to envelop it as fast as possible. And I have to put these guys like this. I think I'm gonna move this chieftain's bodyguard here. There we go. We're gonna meet up with these guys. There we go. And this guy I mean, I want the Isomeg X-Men to attack the others from behind. So I'm predicting that the Fallas Lords, you know, they are... Where are they? Yeah, they are on this side, so might as well just send this guy here. There we go. And this guy, he's good against Cavalry, so might as well send him here to lead the fight over there. Right? This guy's good against Cavalry. Skilled against Mounts, so that's awesome. It's actually what is the the units nine twenty four these guys fourteen fourteen effective against armor this is the unit that that is let's say the killer you know so let's go times six you know he's sending in first some archers it's not a big problem oh sorry I didn't want to do that just want these guys here I would love if you would strike these. Uh, this Dunlending Warband first. Actually, let me put him here. I don't know if that would lure the cavalry. That would be perfect, because they would attack here. That would screw them all. Yeah, these guys are very vulnerable to Archer Fire. So let's see what happens. It seems like the cavalry is actually beelining these guys. So yeah, let's put him here. Oh my god, that's so good. Like, the cavalry is gonna hit, get hit by the archers? This is perfect. At least it's gonna get hit by the archers. To me, That's great. That's a very good use of the archer fire, I mean. It's perfect, actually. Look at that. 45, 40 whatever. Okay, let's get them out. That's perfect. There we go, a couple of shots off. Ah, but they managed to kill that. I wish they would charge here. Well, at least they are under attack by the archers. So there's marinas. There's Fallas Lords. Okay. That's great that the Larry Riders are not doing too much. And now I can hit the Linda Marinas, which is also a very good unit. Okay, I can send these guys there. Okay, so what do we have here? Seems like he's sending all the archers and the Phallus Lords. Okay, he wants these guys, so let me send them back. Yeah, he'll have the range there, so... For now, I'm having these Lina Marinas really well. 
There we go. I mean, yeah, there's the archers, there's the Sindar Spearmen, there's the Sindar archers, and where's the Phallus Lords? There they come. There we go, they're attacking me. So there's the Phallus Lords. I'm gonna have to move these guys here. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome, actually. There we go. Yeah, there we go. These guys should start hitting the gods. Yeah, that's the best unit to hit. There's the Phallus Lords right in the middle. Okay, you guys, you can... Yeah, you're under attack. You're under heavy stress there. So that's what I'm gonna do. This guy is gonna hit those archers just so they won't attack. The landing warband, you're gonna move here. Actually, no, you're gonna go all the way around here. If we continue there we go, come on, we run. Man, they are getting a lot of casualties there. They haven't yet suffered any. So let me hit those guys. Chieftain's bodyguard, let's go over there. There we go, that's a good hit there, that's nice. Yeah, these marines, they're doing nothing. Yeah, that's cool. Friendling huntsman. Come on, there we go, finally. There we go. Yeah, I think the archers are doing that. Cavalry, you gotta get away. You gotta get away and far away and wait for my orders. You've done the, the job that you were supposed to. Take that away. Okay, there's no more marinas here. There's like three of them, so that's fine. Let's slay these Sindar guards. Actually, these Stellari swordsmen should be that. That's perfect. Let's hit this guy. Seems like the archers are moving in, which is quite strange. They're all 31. Actually, let's hit these Teleri swords, shall we? Yeah, let's hit these units. Okay, 25. That's good. The more you can do, the better. Okay, let's send you in. Actually, you're not gonna go over there. You're gonna go over here. Those are Sindar Spearmen. Those are dangerous. Actually, yeah, let's send you over there. I mean, come on. If the general dies fast enough, we're gonna be okay. There we go. Huntsmen have done their job. Actually, I'm gonna take here, right? 17, come on, keep sending those. That's off awesome. You see the guards, I wish they would, you know, rout. Because, honestly, if I kill these fellas lords... And they, they haven't lost half of their men yet. Yeah, but their fellas lord is quite suffering. Yeah, there you go. Right now I have these guys just concentrating there. That's cool. There we go. I'm losing a lot of my men, but okay, these Dunlending warriors. Yeah, I gotta move them here. Like this, we will smash the enemy. Actually, no, I don't have to move them here. I have to move them here. There we go. The Isaac Mac X-Men and those champions. This is paying off. Look at the Fallen Lord dying fast. I mean, already 10. My 
my azimuth unit is full. The Cinder Guards are shaken. If the, the general dies, then it's pretty cool. Like, I predict that these guys immediately route. And maybe these Cinder Spearmen as well. And those... Then it's going to be this this guy. That's going to be the difficult one. Our men have slain the enemy Perfect. So, the General dead. Lose their will to fight. That guy is now fighting to the death. That's perfect. So you guys, you gotta send some forces over there to those Eldarina archers. There we go. These guys probably have finished the everything up. They have lost half their men. Yeah, there we go. Let's go with the huntsmen over there. There we go. These guys, let's go. There we go. There we go. They're all dead now. Okay, I'm sending the Huntsman and the Clansman just to attack there. And now I'm gonna go with this guy. There we go. These don't hear champions. They're gonna attack these guys in the back. They are fighting to the death. That is perfect. This guy can go and attack there. Let's go over here with these units. Wow, that is really cool. It was really cool. It paid off completely. Like, these guys are now fighting to the death, so they are now all fighting to the death. You always have to surround, guys. Because if not, the unit will just stay there. I've lost, what, 60%? It's not a bad deal. It really isn't. I mean, look at this. Still have some warbands. I think I'll have just enough units to hit these all. There we go. Let's see if they flee. So these guys are dead. Those guys are dead. They're all fighting to the death, so they will very soon. Those archers are not. I don't know why. Yeah, I gotta completely surround them and give them something to fear, like all of these guys for sure. There we go. Yeah, the Isaac Mac Axemen, they're gonna go well. There we go. So I still have some archers. I still have all my generals. There we go. He's pushing through, but uh, by doing so, he also dies. So. His men also die a little bit more. There we go. Let's push these guys. Yeah, he's trying to break through. Our men have fought long and are becoming tired. Okay, there we go. Actually, I should should send just everyone in. There we go. This is a great victory, guys. There we go. Yeah, I gotta send this unit because that's the best, you know, the best units. The ones that hack and slash, these are the ones who have to chase them. Yeah, he's just backing away. I can force them with this. I can maybe force them to stay. Well, but I think they're gonna leave, but probably that's okay. Be awed by the victory we have won that was a quite a clear victory and I lost 37%? I was watching 800. Wow, the Leaning Warriors survived entirely. 
this warband as well. The Berserkers kind of halfway. So I think I so suffered like a third of the army. I still have plenty of units here. How about the champions almost entirely? The warriors as well? Like I didn't lose a lot. I lost some clan hunters. But that's okay. I lost units that are quite cheap. Oh god, this is great. <laughs> this is great. It worked out much better than, than what I was thinking. Okay, so I get the CD. If I don't, they'll probably die very easily. Wow. Yeah, execute them all. I, I don't care. Okay, so he still has a CD there. Clans? Oh, because I wasn't sieging it. If I was sieging it, I would capture it. Uh, no, that's bad. They offer a ceasefire here. Now, I'm going to decline, because I really want to finish off well. the clans of Anodwaith here. Okay, they are pushing with almost everything from Gin, so this will be on the next episode. 1,600, but this is a very easy army. And they are on the attack? Really? Like, the River Swordsman is his best unit, and it's not really too important. He, not ha he completely lacks cavalry, which means that I can just kill the Elder Guildsman fast. So that's exactly what we're going to do. But on the next episode, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.